I'm Jermaine Clement. I'm one of the uh, people involved with. He's a person. I'm a person. I'm uh, Taika, and I'm also a person. To make anyone fall in love. So I'm too nervous about doing this with you. I don't want to yeah. fall in love. Well, I mean, it happens to people. You fall in love with you. <laughs> that's something that sometimes. Hey, like Blade Runner. That's another great film. It's actually not though. People say it's so great, but then you watch it. No, it's pretty okay. boring sometimes. Yeah. Some of it's a bit boring. You're boring sometimes. <laughs> When you first started out as a comedy duo in the Humor Beasts, mm -hmm. did you ever envisage that one day you'd be kind of touring the world with, with your kind of feature film that you've made together? Was that always the kind of long-term Oh, ambition? I'd say yes. I didn't envisage that. I, 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 would, I would have. I wish you told me about that. Will we, will we doing a big film? It's kind of uh, it's so much cooler now that I know that it came true. Wish I'd been in on that. So Jermaine and I, we like basically like when we first met we'd like make lists of like types of characters we wanted to play and like somewhere in New Zealand that list still exists and it's like hot doctor scientist pirate uh man made of rocks all these like different things and uh just sort of like just picking our way through the uh, through the list with regards to the the characters you've got Vladislav the poker um he's kind of like the, the, the lothario is that is that how you had seen him what's the lothario i've heard that word the before. lover boy okay yeah of course i've heard that boy. before like what directed at me a lot in my real life like, oh, the lothario. you're like what the heck what are you guys talking about <laughs> give you don't call me, that. <laughs> call me that um oh okay well that really makes sense now okay <laughs> Well, your character's not. Hey Jim, given the choice of anyone in the world, whom would you want as a dinner guest? Anything in there? No, it's empty, Jim. <laughs> Brett was the most keen to go to Edinburgh, and uh, it's also it's winter here in New Zealand around that time, so thought I may as well. It's tight. Do you want to go to Edinburgh as well? And you know, I said, "This is a reenactment." Oh yeah. I mean, yeah. I'd love to go to Edinburgh. Yeah. So the next thing you know, we're all in Edinburgh. Yeah. Why is it your favorite? One of your favorites? Rushmore. Yeah. I think. I, um, I too love Rushmore. I think it's really funny, and uh, that's the main reason, really. Books. Some of my favorite lines are in that movie. I can't. You're not even listening. Yeah. No. This movie. Well, as he said, we're writing together some TV ideas, and um, maybe there'll be TV shows one day. And um, I'm doing a bit of acting. Yeah. You know, you want to see some? Yeah. Good. Why did you do that? Are you back as Jermaine now? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that was me being the next Batman. It's amazing. Wait. Shocking, shockingly scary film. This is Nosferatu by Friedrich Wilhelm Murnau. How's the pronunciation? Murnau. Murnau. I don't know. Um, we kind of have borrowed the character of Nosferatu from this movie, but this movie borrowed the character of Nosferatu from Dracula, and they just changed his name for copyright issues. That's pretty cheeky, but then we've kind of done the same thing to them. Haven't we? Yeah. <laughs> don't eat that banana during oh, the interview. <laughs> <laughs> Amateur. <laughs> <laughs> I can't edit it. It's <laughs> not going to bananas. I hope you're not going to project all vomit, it's are the you? worst thing to eat. <laughs> right, ask me a question now. <laughs> it's a great challenge to um, be directing, but uh, I was working with Taika, so you know, um, if he, he shared the load. Don't eat a banana during this part of the interview. Close, can you make the shot? Can you kind of push him out of the shot? Two banana. On the uh, wing of an aeroplane, had a big session Whew, with Suzanne, <laughs> Suzanne Summers. <laughs> he just whispered to her, they've never made it up with the kid. <laughs> Obviously. He's like, oh yeah, okay, next question. <laughs> they don't know what it is. When did you last sing to yourself or to someone else? I sing to myself most days. Hey, you there with the sad face. Come back to my place. Oh, I think I'm falling in love with you. 
from based on these arts. <laughs> We're up to number five. <laughs> this experiment works. We're turning the film into a TV show, and yeah. we're shooting it down in New Zealand, and it's great. It's just like funny, and it's like you know, Jermaine's one of the best writers I know, and like yeah, the stuff that he's been writing is fantastic, and. Yeah, I can't wait to get started on it. Tyke and I have worked together for a long time. Before we did documentaries, serious documentaries, we used to do comedy shows, theatre and um, film. So we've, we've done a lot of different things. I think we even did a drawing once. The usual process for us is we write together, we wrote the film together, and then when the show came along, I was doing Thor, and so Jermaine was charged with the task of writing the pilot. So it was great for me to come in just as a director, and all the scripts are great, they're really very funny. In fact, probably better that I didn't write on it. Obviously, you co-wrote, co-produced and co-directed. How was, how was it acting and directing at the same time? Well, we had each other to rely on. <laughs> we, so had often. Each other. You know? we had each other. You know? We're not other. like, we're not like two Clint Eastwoods. We, um, we like two Kevin scenes, Costners. I would, I would direct him, usually. Not two Kevin Costners. Oh, you think you. And about the setting to you where you're like, well, now we get to explore this aspect or uh, now we get to kind of, you know, play around with this idea. Just have to explain things a lot more. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, we, uh, we get, you know, it's great, it's great to meet the, the, the new cast is uh, really fun to work with. Sorry. No. No, there were probably about seven or eight people. Do you remember? You were doing the lights. There's about seven or eight people <laughs> in our uh, show, and uh, there was this one woman. If I become president, <laughs> if I become president of the world, or of a, of a country, I would make um, at least one day a month naked day. Okay. So it's just nudity. You have to be nude. Everyone will just stay at home that day. Be... Oh, I don't know. There'll be some clubs and stuff and some cool parties, especially for nudes. I'm going to start uh, with you, Jermaine. This is obviously your, your directorial yeah. debut. Uh, Brett, not <laughs> how was that experience for you? And is it something you'd like to do more of in the future? Share with your partner an embarrassing moment in your life. I was doing life modeling at the fashion school mm. and it was just all girls really, just drawing pictures of nude dudes and um, you were the dude. And I was the dude this one day and I fainted and I passed out on stage mm -hmm. and fell off the stage and crushed an easel. It doesn't sound too embarrassing. I was naked. <laughs> you should have a rest, get some vitamins, have a smoothie. It must be night time by now. We should have just stopped. It's been a long interview. I'm over this. We started in the morning. Turn out these lights, guys. Yeah. She's off, she's not even staying. No, no. All these clothes are free. They won't, he paid for them. So please see the film. Because he's got a little baby. So watch it like this now. Two years took. She's hungry at this stage. She's skinny. Alternate sharing something yeah. you consider a positive characteristic of your partner. Good hair. Thank you. Yeah, I know that one went a lot to you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, can you think of one for me? Remember the last time that I saw you throw up? Well, well, probably the only time. We were on Waiheke Island and you got food poisoning and you made it all the way back to the place we were staying in the car and then you got out of the car and it's the most long distance I've seen vomit travel. Wow, thank amazing. you. And it was like, I thought, it was like we in, in is it like in the movie play that joke when they put like a hose and it just goes <gasps> or like in our movie kind of like in our movie it just went Boy! and i was impressed like thank another you. impressive thing that jermaine's done thank you <laughs> what do you think they how do you think they would cope in a modern city i mean in a modern big city well, like this, london it's a modern place where we, we, we live, yeah. it's, where we live. it's a modern city this isn't a period piece new zealand was like the first place to have if we don't know if you call it if was Call that here? F-Boss? F-Boss? They don't call it that. Yeah, you pay in the shop. The cash card. card. You swipe. Oh, like chip and pin. Point of sale. Oh, okay. And you type in your... your yeah, so pin. now what do you think of yeah. New Zealand? Well, I've got humbled. Took you guys about 10 years yeah. to catch on to that. 
That's why we were one of the first ten years before use you guys. Messages. You were still using cash. We were using cards. Maybe you have the audacity to accuse us of being small town and behind the times. Okay, okay, okay. So, as you can see, bringing what we do in the shadows to America is going to be a pretty big job and a costly one. Well, we've done the main bit. We made the movie. That's it. Are we That's in it. love? I don't know. I feel not mad at you. A little bit more tired. This had the feeling of a relationship that, like, heady and excited in the first flourishes, yeah. until it felt like we were just repeating ourselves. Yeah. Again and again, exactly like a relationship. I think this works. Mm.